Have you ever found yourself at a concert that left you more disappointed than entertained? Imagine the anticipation, the excitement, and then, alas, the letdown. Yes, it happens. Even the best of artists can sometimes fall short. Today, we delve into the world of music lovers who've had the less than stellar fortune of experiencing the worst concerts they've ever attended. A recent trend on Twitter saw fans sharing their first, last, worst, and best concerts among others. The results? Quite surprising. First up, a fan listed Iron Maiden as their first concert, and shockingly, Metallica as their worst. Bear in mind, Metallica is a heavy metal band that has sold over 125 million albums. A testament to the fact that popularity doesn't always guarantee a memorable live performance. Next, we have a music enthusiast whose loudest concert was Motorhead and the most surprising Soundgarden, but their worst, Blink-182. Quite a revelation for a band that won Best Group Video for All the Small Things at the 2000 MTV Video Music Awards. Further along the list, we find a fan who had Jimmy Buffett as the best and most seen concert. However, this same fan listed Metallica as their worst concert. Another fan had Metallica as their loudest concert, but named Natalie Merchant as their worst. One music lover's first concert was Green Day, their loudest was System of a Down, and their best was Paul McCartney. However, their worst was Neil Young, a member of the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame and listed on Rolling Stone's 100 Greatest Musical Artists. To recap, some of the worst concert experiences, surprisingly, include popular bands like Metallica, Blink-182, and even legendary artists like Neil Young. Remember, these are subjective experiences, and what might be music to one's ears could be noise to another. So the next time you find yourself at a less than satisfactory concert, remember, you're not alone. It's all part of the rich tapestry of live music experiences. And who knows, your worst concert story might just make for a fascinating Twitter thread someday.